Queensland will be kicking off. New South Wales won the toss. They elected to have first touch of the football. We're underway and the Breezers caught that ball immediately from the kickoff and incredibly Queensland had first touch of the football. Five tackles gone. They got numbers to the blind side and Madison Stone puts the grubber kick in behind the defence. Uh, stacks on the mill and eventually uh, the ball's been battered dead by Katie Tinker in the face of Hannah Seo. Tough for a dummy half. They go across to Studden. Cut out pass. Looking for wing three quarter in Hannah Seo. Can she get there? No. Next to the left hand upright from dummy half it's uh, Brayley across to Karen Murphy inside outside pass for Renee Cuts Cuts is there Cuts scores the first try of the interstate challenge and in she comes right boot strikes it no problem straight down the middle for Ali Brigginshaw 15 out from the New South Wales line back to the open side five tackles gone Brigginshaw grubber kick in behind the defence it's been played at six more tackles picked up by, by Heather Ballinger Ballinger leads back to Deanna Turner Turner's close Turner's there it was a nice little kick and it deflected and the, the pick up there from Deanna Turner. She picked that up and it was just some great footwork there and she reminds me of reminiscent of uh, Gordon Tallis, the way she runs the ball and she just barnstormed straight over about three or four New South Wales uh, Blues. Brayley dummy half, they go left side to Murphy. Here's trouble. Murphy, beautiful short pass out wide. Here comes some numbers. Here's Kelly Hodges. Hodges is over in the corner. That could be game. Set bingo already. That could be 16 years in a row for Queensland. Are utilising it better than the team that has the breeze. Now imagine what they can do with the breeze behind them. Unfortunately that conversion was not successful. Yeah. Tau fight dummy half, links up with Cunts. Cunts out wide towards... Uh, uh, Jenny Sue Hopper, she throws the dummy. Jenny Sue Hopper, she's close, she's there. She's kicked two from three so far. And she comes, right boot strikes. It starts off okay. Five tackles gone. Are they going to go that way again? No, they go blind side, right side. Taufa from dummy half goes herself. Oh. Links up there with Tina Clark. Is she there? Yes, she is. Stutton. Right boot strikes. I tell oh. you what, looks all right off the boot. Oh. Hits the left hand upright and bounces back. Brayley at dummy half, links up with Karen Murphy, the, the master, the whiz, here's to Stephanie Hancock, Hancock barrels Sam Hammond out of the way and crashes over to score. She reads the game beautifully and I've not seen someone do that for a while, here's the kick. And it's successful from Jenny, from Jenny Sue Hopper, speeches from both captains and presentation of the Nelly Doherty Challenge Cup is stunning. Lovely shot ball for Cassie Apps, who's away, she's got the full back to beat in, 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 the, in the, the Talia Patina Lawrence, she gets outside of her and that is a sensational try for Cassie Apps right underneath the post. The An absolute beauty. From 10 out right in front of the post, she converts. 10 seconds to go. This will probably be the last tackle of the match. It's Taufer at dummy half. New South Wales will probably try and run it for the last tackle of the match. Here's Eliana Walton. Walton stands. She's met and put to the ground by uh, Deanna Turner as the siren goes in the background. And ladies and gentlemen, for the 16th successive year, Queensland have reigned supreme. The Nelly Doherty Challenge Cup once again goes back north of the Tweed for a 16th successive year.